Hey guys, it's her name is me. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how I've mastered a wash and go. Now I don't know if you guys know, but I never do wash and goes because I've never got them the way I like them until these products. So keep watching. So as you can see, I am starting on old dry hair. I do not want to do a freshly washed wash and go because I do not want to take forever to dry. You know, when you're walking out the house and you slopping everybody with your wet hair, I don't want to do that. So I'm doing it on dry hair so it'll dry faster. So I'm sectioning my hair into very small sections. So again, I'm going to do this on small section of my hair and the first thing I'm going to do is damp my hair with some water. You don't want it like super wet, but you don't want it like too dry either. So just find your happy medium. Again, it's, it's not a bad thing if it is too wet. It'll take longer to dry. So as my leave-in, I'm using the main choices Ancient Egyptian Breakage and Repair Antidote Cuticle Control Leave-In. So I love this leave-in lotion because it's not too heavy on my hair, but it still does its job. So as you can see, I'm not using a whole lot, but I'm going to apply that to my hair. And I'm going to smooth that in from my roots to my ends. Next, I'm going to be using the main choices hair gold. No, literally, hair gold. The 24 karat gold twisting gel. This gel has been so awesome. I love this gel for my twist outs, my braid outs, and now my wash and go. The one thing I never liked about using gel for a wash and go, and like I've said, I've never mastered it, is because it makes it crunchy, your hair is all hard, but with this gel, like literally guys, I have so much definition and my hair is so soft in the end. So I apply my gel from the roots to the ends and you wanna make sure you get to your roots because you do not want puffy roots in the end. So I'm gonna just smooth that through my hair. You can choose to go down the length of your hair or you can do a coily motion as you can see me doing there. It's really up to you. You can do a mix of both or one or the other, it doesn't matter. This technique is gonna ensure that my curls clump together and that the product is on every strand from root to tip. Both of these products along with the rest of the Ancient Egyptian line are available at Sally Beauty. Be sure to check out the store locator at www.themainchoice.com. So I'm already done with one side of my hair and already you can see the definition and that my curls are really popping already and they're not even dry. So my hair is all done and as you can see my curls are popping already even though they are not dry yet. So I'm just going to kind of scrunch my hair up which is going to help define those curls even more. So I'm going to allow my curls to air dry overnight. You can choose to use a diffuser if you do want to speed up the drying process and you have somewhere to go. And as you can see my curls are popping and at this point all I'm going to do is pick out my roots. I'm also going to put my part where I desire it, but guys, this is a style that literally lasted me a week. I love this wash and go. My hair stayed soft, it stayed moisturized, it stayed defined throughout the full week. If you like this tutorial, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell button so you don't miss any of my videos. Be sure to connect with me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter.